how are you all doing i hope you're all doing fine welcome back to my channel if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for your love and your support i really appreciate much but if it's your first time here on my channel hello welcome to my channel please before you leave remember to subscribe and when you subscribe click on that notification bell you will find it down there so that you'll be the first one to be notified whenever i upload a new video i promise you you will always enjoy every content that i upload on this channel so dear friends just like i promised on my last video where i shared Simpson and gabriel's online dating success love story I told you the next video we will be sharing with you how to navigate through interracial dating central because that is where Simpson found the love of her life. So in the last video, yes, I had wanted to share with you how to navigate through interracial dating central because Simpson sent me some videos. So after going through the videos she sent me and some screenshots, because I know you guys very, very well. <laughs> I told Singto, you know what? I am going to be posting this in the next video because I think there is some information that I want to add in. I know some of my subscribers are slow learners. So only showing them the screenshots, <laughs> you still have lots of questions to ask me and I know in the comment section, everyone will be like, Bella, how to do this? Bella, you did not explain this. Bella, due to how you guys are used to my videos, I share with you everything into details. So that is what I am going to be doing today. Yes, I am going to be sharing with you the information that Sinto shared with you guys concerning how to navigate through interracial dating central. But at the same time, you will also get a bit of my information showing you how to navigate through interracial dating central. Aren't you excited guys? For me, I am very, very excited. <laughs> so without wasting much of your time, let's jump into this. First, I welcome our dearest Sinto. <laughs> yeah. Bella, good morning. I'll be sending a video on how to register on Interracial Dating Central. To register, you just go to www. www interracial dating centra so the centra is spelled c-e-n-t-r-a-l interracial dating centra when you go on the website you see login or register because you're a new user you'll be clicking on the register when you register you input your email and your selected password they will send a link to your email to verify your account you click on that link to verify it and it will redirect you to the website where you can log in to your dashboard when you log into your dashboard the first things you need to do is to upload your pictures once you upload pictures you set up your profile you write about you you write um the things you're looking for we made a video on our page about how to create an online dating profile like things to write things to include on your about you section and the type of pictures to upload to increase your chances once you've done all that there is a at the top right corner there's three lines there you click on it to take you to your profile when you get to your profile to say uh, edit your match ideally you want to select the preferred country you want because automatically the profile the website will just be matching you to people within your country but if you go to your preferred match criteria you select the countries you want ideally you want to select any country you prefer if you prefer us uk um, germany netherlands italy any of the countries you want you just select them and then you go to your filter that same uh, filter you go to the age range 
you select the age you want maybe from 35 to 45 or from 30 to 40 or anyhow any preferred age range so you will not be matched with people younger or people older than your preferred age bracket after that you can start um swiping through profile usually that interracial dating website does not allow you send while you're swiping uh, the interracial dating central website does not allow you send a message if you're not a paid uh, um, premium account you holder but you can send first impressions so usually just swipe through the profiles and click on the love icon you know the heart icon just click that would prompt them that you are flirting with them they call it flirt they can flirt with you back and you can also try sending messages but if the person is not a paid premium user the person cannot read your if you're both for example if you try to send a message and see that you can't that means that person is not a paid member but if the person has paid you'll be able to read their message so usually the first step is to send them a flat they will flat with you back and if the like the inbox the chats the messaging you know when they flat with you back to show as message once you open the message if it allows you to send message to them you know that they are a paid member if it doesn't allow you to send message to them you just know that they are not a paid member that's the way you would know but usually because i wasn't a paid member what i was doing is just to send as much uh, flat as i can in a day you can just spend maybe 20 minutes 30 minutes just sending flat the flat is quite easy just scroll through their profile and click on the heart icon thank you very much <laughs> So yes guys, after getting all the information that Sinto gave to you, please guys, you have to implement it. But now it's time for me to show you exactly how things looks like if you are inside Interracial Dating Central. I'm going to be using an online dating profile of one of my clients that we haven't yet started working. I just told her, fill in everything and then I'll come in to see if what you filled in is okay. And if it is not okay, then I'm going to help you <laughs> put everything well <laughs> as it is supposed to be. So let's dive into this. So guys, uh, I imagine you have created your account already, so there is no need for you to, you know, fill in here because you will have filled in everything. So you go to log in. So guys, this is my client's account. When you log in and you are a free member, this will appear. So don't freak out and start being like, oh my God, Bella, they're not allowing me in. What can I do? <laughs> you need to just click here, upgrade later. Okay. So after clicking on upgrade later, you will go straight to your profile. If it is your first time to use Interracial Dating Central, I want to take you through the whole process step by step on how you navigate when using interracial dating central so number one thing after you have logged in they're going to bring you here and after bringing you here what you see here the first thing that i would recommend you to check on is your profile you click on your profile and after clicking on your profile they're going to show you if your profile is complete or it's not complete and this is the sign to show you if the profile is complete you see the line is still not complete 40 percent complete so that means my client has got a lot of work to do for her profile to complete you can see on her details there is an x which means it's not complete then about me not complete i'm looking for is not complete she has got only photos so these things here are very very important never ignore them and be like no i'm just going to leave it like that important and beautiful you know <laughs> i'm going to get messages from serious guys no 
it won't happen till you complete your profile when you see upgrade don't freak out i repeat <laughs> you are using a free version so just keep on ignoring it so let us go to my details which is very very important so first click on my details and after clicking on my details follow all the steps you know <laughs> so i am a woman you know she's a woman uh date of birth and where she's coming from she filled in everything but if you have not filled in just filled in on the location you fill in where you come from then we go down my ethnicity is black if you're a black woman but if you're not a black woman maybe you're from asia you just click on asian if you are from pacific islander you just click here other you click you know <laughs> so the main point here is click on your ethnicity okay just choose when it makes tick that means that's your ethnicity so that means this one is a white woman <laughs> yeah but this account is of a black woman our sister so that one is okay you see on the ethnicity there is a tick so we go down here status there is single currently separated divorced widowed so you choose your status if you're single only single you just click on single if you currently separated you click on separated if you divorced you click on divorced if you widowed you click on widowed but this client of mine is currently separated so we click there eye color there is black blue brown gray so she is black she has got black eye color so you click there and you see whenever you finish like clicking it puts a tick on it okay that means for that part is complete so we come to hate she had to put her hate so it's complete we come to religion she is a christian so you just choose here if you're atheist all these muslim jewish spiritual all that christian so we done we go to education um some college so this one is done to occupation he works in healthcare so that one is complete we go here languages she speaks english she also knows some a bit of swahili so you see it's thick you save and continue but before saving let's go up to make sure all is filled in well so you see <laughs> we skip some things here hair color she has got black hair color body type uh, average so we keep going down all is okay so now we can save and continue so just an update here before it was 42 now we see after filling in it's 58 percent you know yeah so let's continue guys so here they are telling you one line that sets you apart from the crowd so here you have to have something exciting something about love something that you know something that will catch someone's attention and write it here on the headline so i am going to think of something and help her fill in here so guys what came into my mind is i still believe true love exists okay so you leave it like that so when a guy comes across your profile, they're going to see the headline is I still believe true love exists. And you see, we have a tick already. 
so we come on how do you describe yourself so the headline is done we got the description and i see she described herself so never ignore the description part and on the description part that is where you write in about your character who are you you know <laughs> And also, what are your hobbies? What are those things that you really like to do when you are free? You write them all here. Without forgetting, guys, about your love part or your love side. Who are you when it comes to love? It's very, very important. And this is something like, you know, you are promising a guy that is reading your profile if he is to fall in love with you you know how are you just a bit of it so never forget that please please so guys i had to add something when it comes to love though she had added that i'm very very loving but i added i still believe true love exists despite the past bad love relationship experience that one goes through you see so this lady is a single mom there is a meaning to this that if a guy gets curious you know to get to know her she will explain more than you coming and fill in everything <laughs> that you went through you know in your past in your description no never do that but just write just a hint of it and show someone that is reading your profile that you are a positive woman you know despite the challenges you know you still want to go ahead with your life you still want to fight <laughs> and find that true love so let me hope on the description you understood and from today you will write very very good descriptions <laughs> so let's continue uh with the profile now here want children if you want more children you're just going to click want more children and decided about wanting children if you have not decided yet you click here if you don't want children you click here if you can't have children you also click here you choose the one that you know suits you what you really want when it comes to children you know oh your situation <laughs> yeah so there is a tick because want more children though she's a single mom of two smoking you click also i hate smoking smoke daily do not smoke but is but okay if you do smoke occasionally <laughs> so this lady never said that she doesn't want a guy who smokes so we are going to click here do not smoke but okay if you do let's continue drink never drink don't drink drink socially okay so never drink tick ideally i'd live in a city property in the country beach house tent in the woods house in the suburbs cabin in the mountains stilled house in the jungle an adobe home in the desert <laughs> so you choose here and i'm going to choose for her property in the city and i'll also click house in the suburbs two of them because you have got lots of options you can click even three of these so the last will be in the city so when a guy comes across your profile he will know that yes you can live in the city so if he lives in the city he's gonna be interested property in the country if he lives you know in the country he's gonna be interested if he lives in the suburbs then you have tick he will know that yes this lady can live where i live but if a guy comes and he lives let's say in the jungle in the mountains in the desert he will not be interested in you <laughs> okay so yeah this is a tick and we go ahead with our profile so my fashion sense is jeans t-shirt all the time love designer i hate fashion 
<laughs> designer wear. Dress according to the occasion, wear the latest trends, sporty jogging, shoes and trackies. So this lady dress according to the occasion. So we have tick. So my sense of humor, we are going to click the last one, which is light-hearted. I like cheerful, gentle, fun. We continue. When I go to parties, <laughs> I'm in the life of the party. I'm in the background enjoying myself. Click here. We continue, guys. So on a day off, I enjoy catching up on household chores because this is a single mom guys i attend religiously service so here you click on what you do these things are very very personal guys and uh, just be honest with yourself fill in on how you do things so this lady goes in the church or at church once a week we continue so to work i work only few hours a week relocation i would like to relocate within my city i would relocate anywhere in the world she's ready so we continue to hear all is done so you save and continue you see guys we are 87 percent for her profile to be complete now they take you to tell us what you are looking for in a man so when it comes to what you're looking for in a man so most of you guys always ignore this part and be like ah, it's not important <laughs> but it's very very important for a serious guy a guy should know what you are really looking for so when he reads what you're looking for in a man then he will know if you guys are a match or you are not a match using the things that you filled in okay <laughs> it's so so important guys i insist so guys on what you're looking for in a guy i know you have lots of things that you are looking for in a guy but you can't write everything in here <laughs> it will be too much for someone to read but write those important things like really really important things to you in a man so if it is me searching for a guy what I would look for in a guy, I would look for in a guy who is very, very hardworking, a guy who is a one woman man, you know, he is honest, faithful, <laughs> caring, he should be generous, he should be human. I've seen most of you searching for a guy who is religious, but you forget the human thing, which is very, very important, guys. So always include it in what you're looking for in a guy. So this guy should be human, but above all, should love you for who you are. And if you are a single mother, should love you with your kids, because you come as a full package. Yeah, <laughs> he shouldn't expect to love only you and forget your kids. So after filling in what you're looking for in a guy, you should remember to put in the disclaimer. I've seen most of you writing a disclaimer on your description, which is wrong. The disclaimer goes in what you're looking for in a guy. Yes. So tell scammers, players, time wasters that we are looking for something different. So please better don't bother to message me. If you message me, I will not respond to you. So respect my time as I respect yours. Thank you. I also know that most of you ignore the disclaimer and be like, no, it's not important because after all, Bella, these scammers players will write to me. <laughs> No, guys, when you write that, you reduce the number of players, time wasters, okay? So, always include your disclaimer. 
So after filling in all that and on what you're looking for is done, you keep going. So yes guys, as you can see, I have helped her write what she is looking for in a guy. So we continue looking for ethnicity. So here we see white and maybe I would add this for her um, and mixed. So you see, it's done. So after finishing looking for ethnicity and we made a choice, but I think I'll just remove these ones and leave only white because she had selected white before here. So interest in the selected ethnicities, so exclusive white. <laughs> okay, so seeking friends. It's important. This is very, very important. Seeking for friends, seeking for pinpoint, seeking for long-term marriage, or dating and romance. Exist white guys or exist guys online that their intention to be on the dating app or dating site is only to date you. That's it. They don't plan to get married. So you should be very, very careful here, guys. So for you, you are searching for long-term marriage you see she clicked on long-term marriage and we are done you save and continue click so it is telling us 96 almost complete guys <laughs> let's go down and see what is missing so i went on my details because it is showing 96 and the things that are not yet complete we still have excellent details and about me so maybe we skipped something that is why i had to go and when i came here a star sign so i know she is a cancer and we are going to click here on cancer we have a tick then we save and continue so guys, you see the details, on the details it is done, now we have remained with about me, so we skipped this thing here, they're showing it to us, about children, no children, children not at home, children at home, the status, you know, if you don't have children then you just click here and it's done, but this lady has got children so children at home so we go down down to see if we skipped anything else nothing all is complete we save so after saving yay our profile guys is complete <laughs> ready to search so i'm going to take you through another Thing that is very very important for you to know so before I take you to what I promised you that we continue with something else on the age I think this lady made a mistake she's 24 so she can't want someone 18 to 99 uh, she will want at least someone from from 30 to maximum 45 so always remember to save and continue so guys we are going to continue and they're telling her to upload five photos i think she needs to add some more photos so what we go to now we are going to click on my account so when you click on my account it is going to bring you my details. We are, we are done with my details. We worked on that. Now notifications. Of course, I know no notifications yet. Filters. Just wanted to show you. But we have blocked friends, billing, privacy. But for now, let's work on filters. It's important. Click on it. And so on filters, you're going to see it like this. Message and flat filters. Okay, only receive messages and flats from people. Here we have with a photo. 
who live in country who are men of course <laughs> of course you're looking for a man not a woman within my preferred rage age of course we have chosen already 30 to 45 who want the same type of a relationship it's important guys otherwise you're going to get messages from guys who wants only to date or who only want friendship <laughs> and you're looking for someone who wants marriage yeah so let's start i want only to receive messages and flats from people with a photo so you go till here and click you see green we live in any country so here are the options we have any country so any country leave it like that for now who want the same type of a relationship of course so we come to ethnicities and with the ethnicities this lady chose all ethnicities but she is interested in a white guy so what you're going to do they are giving you the instructions who are from the following ethnicities select the ethnicities you want to connect with so we are only going to select white european after selecting it we go down here so guys after selecting everything it will look like this and when everything is filled in like this selected like this we are going to continue and when you go to search the results that are going to come will be through your filters they're going to bring men just like the way you filtered so we are done with filters now we are going to something else that is important which is search you click on search and when you click on search they're going to show you members online new members recently active most popular upcoming birthdays updated profiles custom search so if you want to see men who are online or members who are online of course you're searching for men so you click on online members and as the result you see guys because you had filtered you're not going to see any guy of any color all these that are coming up are white guys because you had filtered already so that's the importance of filtering and these are men who are online and if you want to make your first move you start making your first move here with these guys that are online okay <laughs> but remember if you want to make any first move read the profile first because when you read the profile that is when you will know if the guy matches what you are searching for so this guy we can see on seeking you are seeking for marriage but this guy is seeking for friends pinpoint long-term dating <laughs> all these and it's kind of scary for me to message a guy like this because <laughs> he's okay you can be friends pen pal, and maybe <laughs> long term dating <laughs> yeah but if you want to make the first move then you start from here but i'll show you in a minute how to do that you first read on his description and you go to what he's looking for it's important but his heading headline really is scary so <laughs> <laughs> I won't message a guy like this. I'm hoping to find any ebony lady, black lady, with beautiful feet for regular meeting and feet worship. Hope that's not weird. <laughs> it's weird, oh, it's weird. Bye. <laughs> so I can't message a guy like this, but this is the importance of reading a guy's profile. Don't just see his photos and say, oh, wow, he's cute. Let me message him. No, don't do that so let me take you back on search we are going to click here again and online members have explained what it is 
new members these are members that just joined today this minute <laughs> or yesterday but they're new they're still new uh these ones are good you can make the first move but still remember to read the profile okay because it doesn't mean any new member is genuine though through new member you can find someone really good if you compare with popular member most popular <laughs> He are recently active. These are people that were active recently. Then most popular. These ones I'm not interested at all. <laughs> people have been on the app for three years. I don't know really. Upcoming birthdays. People with their upcoming birthdays. Uh, here you can, you know, make your first move. Click and read the profiles. Then you can make that first move if the profile impresses you. And we have updated profiles, people who recently updated their profiles. And here we have custom search, which is what I want us to look into now. So guys, yeah, custom search. We come here. Uh, this, this lady had selected like this, but I want to take you through. So you see a pen here after, after clicking on search. You click on the pen it is going to bring you here but what is appearing here is what she had said before so for us uh, what you're going to do come here and just select again the age maybe 35 to um, to 50 uh, photos only and who are online now okay you click here and here then click continue after clicking continue they are asking you um, about the country so we can either leave America or if you don't want to leave America you can add any country that you want to search you know to customize uh, so for me I will just leave America and I click continue so I'm looking for men interested in women aged 35 to 50 with photos and are online location United States and ethnicity only wazungu <laughs> yeah so let's search guys and see the results you click on search here after clicking on search you see they are bringing you these guys, American guys, and all are online because that's how you customized your search. So <laughs> you keep going down, you keep going down. If you're using a laptop, you will keep clicking here to see other guys. But for me now, let's end there. And we have this side, which is the quick search. So you select what you want and search by nickname you know then click search now after writing in everything that you want to search about they're going to bring the results yeah but we are done here on the search but if you want to change and maybe see men from different countries you keep changing on the country the age remains the same and other stuff remains the same you only change the country click search they're going to bring men in that particular country maybe i do this as fast as possible uh for example on the country to understand what i am trying to tell you um australia mm, let's click on austria and we continue you see the guys that they brought they only brought only one guy that is from austria <laughs> That's the only result that came in, but they're still telling you the following are outside your search location, Austria. So you can just decide to take a look to from other countries like Germany, Belgium, and all that. Let me hope on this custom uh, search you understood. So guys, quickly, let's go back to custom search and then... I want us to send some messages. Oh, wow. They brought lots of now from Austria. Yeah. So, 
what we do now we want to send a message i want to show you how to send a message to a guy on interracial dating central which is important okay so i see some strange strange headlines like vanilla is for ice cream only goodness i'm here to find you that's not bad so let's let's click on this profile that is written i'm here to find you and read it so i'm here to find you first of all we need to see seeking long term which is a match because that's what we are searching for too um we read oh my goodness this is all his description it's a lot but yeah this is uh his description and this is what he's looking for in a lady a nice and calm woman who knows what she wants no games something serious i'm calm and relaxed so i can accept lots of things but lies as long as you're looking for some serious relationship and you're open to relocate in any case let us give it a try okay on what this guy is looking for it's a match with my client so with interracial dating central Sinto told us you cannot message a guy if a guy is not paying sadly we cannot know if a guy is paying on this dating site we cannot know there is no sign so the only thing that will show you is the message so try to send a message and as you can see they are telling you to upgrade <laughs> that means he's not paying so what do we do we send a flirt okay so when it comes to send a flirt you can decide to send coffee or this or teddy bear or flower and for me i'm just going to send a flower to this guy okay it is sent when you see here the flirt is sent so sinto advised us to flirt with men online okay <laughs> so flirt with many 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 as you can and if someone really reads your profile is a guy and likes you he will think of paying if he's not paying okay yeah but flirt 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 so sending this flirt you can go back and read someone else profile keep flirting so guys this is the favorite part favorite and they bring you the number of people who favorited you favorited me my client <laughs> mutual favorites that means you favorited the guy and he favorited you too so that means mutual favorites so this lady has no mutual favorites she has got three guys that is their favorite yeah <laughs> so if you want to favorite a guy read his profile and if you think he's convincing you you like him you just click on this star okay you click on the star you click on the star that means these are your favorites so when he gets a notification you favorited him he will also read your profile and favorite you back then that's a mutual favorite and you can start maybe chatting from there if he is a paying member but if you favorite someone by a mistake you just remove remove okay yeah another thing are the views these are men who viewed her profile this is the number and when we go to inbox messages we have this guy <laughs> that oh my god why is that she has not responded yet i told her to respond why because when this guy sent a message i saw it and i responded these were my response and i told her to come and um respond to him and i see he responded again oh no okay i'm going to respond to him and talk to her that is why guys i've been telling you please put more efforts put more efforts please please yeah so this was on monday and today is wednesday 
I hope he won't run and see maybe she's not serious. Yeah, but you see, I want to show you an example that if a guy is paying, you guys can chat, okay? You can chat. Like you see here, my client does not pay, but we can communicate with this guy. So here is my response and I want to show you that I am sending a message. And yes, my message went. Okay. So yeah. And lastly, guys, let's go to my profile. So you click here on my profile and they are telling you edit my profile, preview my profile, add more photos. So if you want to add photos, you click on add more photos and add. Okay. Another thing is if you want to edit your profile, you click here and then go edit your profile. This is all about your profile. So guys, lastly, you click on inbox if you want to see your messages and flirts. And if are the messages, you click here. If are the flirts, you click here on flirts to see who flirted you. <laughs> yeah, so we are done. But there is a notification here. If you see this notification, do not freak out, but read it. Your profile is awaiting review within the next 24 hours. To get our priority, review the service. So what you're going to do is wait, wait within 24 hours to check in if everything, the information you filled in, it is the way it is supposed to be after 24 hours. And also if you uploaded some photos, see if those photos are uploaded. Don't upload photos and expect immediately the system will show you the photos or will show your photos to the guys online. No, you have to wait. Okay. <laughs> so friends, before I end this video, I want to talk about something that I've been coming across a lot. You guys send me DMs on my Instagram. Some of you right here on the comment section. I always share dating apps, dating sites for you guys to try out. But immediately after going to that dating site, I don't know what comes over you. You know you are a free member, but at that same same time, you come back and start complaining. It does not work. Even I remember there is a lady who really got me so, so angry. I'm not someone who gets angry easily, but she really got me angry because was commenting of the video I posted and was like, it's a flop because that dating app did not work out at all. <laughs> They are not even allowing me to send messages to guys. But at the same time, I told you before you use any dating app or dating site, get to know how it operates. Get to know how to navigate through. And most of the dating apps right now, most of them guys, they have got a free version of it and a paid version. So if you are using a dating app for free, don't expect to get all the privileges <laughs> of a guy or of a person who is paying on that dating app while you are using a free version. So be happy with the free features that the dating apps are offering you. Use them very, very well. If they're giving you flirts, send as many flirts as you can. Some dating apps are only offering you one week free trial, two weeks free trial. Use those two weeks effectively cause I've got testimonies of ladies that found love on their first week of trial. So try your luck too guys. Who knows? I told you guys that this year, let us be determined. If I'm giving you information, implement it. Don't wait for someone to push you. You are the one that really needs to settle down. Find a right guy, that quality guy. So put some efforts too. It is very, very sad for me to see a lady complaining, I'm not finding love on online dating apps, Please, Bella, connect me. And these days I share photos of guys on my Instagram. I have so many reasons to why I share those guys' photos. I tell you, if you know this guy, 
please contact me and i'm so thankful most of you have been reaching out to tell me bella i know this guy but exist ladies who are very very desperate i've written even on a guy's photo that Oh my god guys be careful when you're out there on online dating apps and the lady comes to tell you bella connect me to him i ask a lady do you know him no i don't know him but we will get to know each other like are you for real <laughs> Guys, let's not take things very simply, especially you ladies that are searching for interracial dating. Be careful. Not every white guy is a saint. <laughs> In Swahili, there is this saying that, Siyo kila mzungu ni padri. <laughs> it's funny, but it's so relatable that not all white guys on online dating apps are saints let us take enough time to get to know these people let us not be in a hurry let us not be desperate you know when i start talking i don't finish so let us end here i wish you all the best last time i shared how to use f dating and we already have a story from that video that i shared so i am very positive i'm so hopeful that even from this video of today how to navigate through interracial dating central we are going to get loads of success stories from it so thank you so much guys for watching this video be blessed if you have liked this video give it a thumbs up share it with your friends family everyone that you think will enjoy this video and learn something watch my other videos too they are super super good Comment below what you think about this video. Until next time, guys, I love you so much. You're always here in my heart. Ciao, ciao. Mwah.